Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to show you how to turn your clean light off on your instant multifunction coffee maker. Model number DPCM-1100. So this newer model has a clean light. So if your clean light comes on, it's time to descale. Or if your 10 and 12 ounce buttons are flashing at you, that also is telling you it's time to descale. This light will come on after 300 cycles. So we've got to put the machine into a descale mode and we're going to be using distilled white vinegar. You can use regular white vinegar. So first thing, empty your reservoir and then we're going to put 16 ounces of vinegar and then we're going to fill the rest up with water. Okay, so I poured the pure vinegar. I've got 16 ounces, which is two cups. So if you don't have a measuring cup, just fill it up to the minimum line. With, with vinegar. Then we're going to go from the min minimum line all the way to the max with pure water. That'll give us our proper ratio. Okay, it's all filled up. You're going to need a container to hold the hot water that's coming out. And we'll be using the manufacturer's cleaning descaling procedures. Okay, so with the unit powered on, you're going to hold the 10 and the 12 ounce buttons together until we go into descaling mode. Okay, the clean light comes on and we're in descaling mode and we've got liquid coming out. So it's a good idea to have another container close by. You're gonna, this is gonna get full and then you're gonna have to empty it into this and keep it, it's gonna keep doing this. And then you gotta empty this and put it over here until that, until it gets all the way down to the minimum, until the add water light comes on. So logically, we gotta make sure that add water light comes on and that'll take us out of descaling mode and turn the clean light off. So what it's doing, it's just kind of, it runs some through and then it stops, runs some through and stops. And so before, be careful that water coming out is hot. So now we can. Now you can descale this more often if you would like. I try to descale mine about every six to seven months. If you've got really hard water, I would do it every four to five months. But if your coffee or your espresso is not as hot as it used to be, or if it's not tasting as good, or if your machine is really loud, those are all signs that it needs descaled too. Okay, so this has been running for about 20, 25 minutes. We're getting really close to the add water light coming on. We're still in clean mode, but once that add water light comes on, we'll come out of descale mode. So it hasn't come out of clean mode. We're really low. I don't want to run this thing dry. The add water light should have come on by now. I don't like when things don't work. Yep, it's going to run dry and I don't like to do that. So I would stop it. I would not let my machine I would not let my machine run dry. It's really bad on them. So hit the power button before it runs dry. Yeah, now the add water light comes on. I, I don't like that. The add water light should have came on. It should have taken us out of descale mode. I would turn power off before I ran my machine dry. That is really bad on it on a pump to run dry. So you can see it runs all that water through. You got to have a container ready to go that'll hold hot water. Okay, so now it's time. We got to clean this reservoir. It's still going to have some vinegar and water left in there. So let's go wash this out with soap and water and fill it up to the max line with water. And if you want, be careful. This is going to be really hot, but you could rinse this out too just to get it nice and clean. Okay, I've got my water tank filled up with fresh water. Now they want us to re repeat the process. My clean light is out. I'm out of descale mode. Turn the machine on. Hit the 10 and 12 ounce buttons together. Go back into descale mode. Has to prime the pump since it ran out of water. Now they want you to run this whole tank of fresh water through. Now I'm going to stop it. I'm not going to let this thing suck dry again. When it gets down to the minimum mark, I'm going to come up here and hit the power button and stop it. Again, have another container ready. It's going to run this fresh water through. Once it runs that amount of water through, your machine should be ready to go. It should have removed all the vinegar and taste and smell inside the machine. 
Okay, so I'm getting close to the minimum. Go ahead and hit the, yeah. Hitting the power button stops the process and the machine won't run dry. That, that's what we should have done when we were running the vinegar through, but that's what we're doing when we run the fresh water through. Now, when we turn it back on, we're out of descale mode and the machine is ready to be used. Thanks everybody for watching. If you could, please like and subscribe.